Things like ERP and Void Deck are part of everyday life for Singaporeans. But do Singaporeans know what these terms are in Mandarin? <笑>我想把我的心拆一下因为现在厦门很贵所以我需要搭火车去欧南园现在厦门很贵所以我需要搭地铁到欧南园 <笑> Speak Mandarin Campaign 2012 has launched a new iPhone app, iHuayu, which makes translating local lingo into proper Mandarin as easy as ABC. It offers working executives and businessmen a platform to learn, as well as enhance the vocabulary of commonly used business terms in Mandarin. Basically, focus, there are two things. Focus on business uh, and Singapore-centric term. iHuayu, which costs between $50,000 and $60,000 to develop, has a glossary of 50,000 terms and 10 everyday scenarios where Mandarin may be used. Users can listen to the pronunciation of words and suggest new words to include. An Android version is slated for the middle of 2013. 以及工作人士在日常生活中轻松自然地使用华语 Let me now speak on how we can encourage Singaporeans to 多用华语 First, keep it fun We have set up the Lee Kuan Yew Fund for Bilingualism to focus on supporting initiatives that enhance the quality of teaching and learning of mother tongue languages and English especially for preschoolers besides developing its own initiatives the fund recently launched a public call for proposers. I'm hopeful that such proposers will incorporate the elements of fun in the teaching and learning of the mother tongue languages, including Mandarin. Second, expose the young to Chinese-speaking environments. The university students I mentioned earlier are beneficiaries of the one-year program where they live, work, and study in China for the entire year. However, for some time now, we have been investing in opportunities to put even younger students in touch with Chinese-speaking environments. Last year alone, more than 15,000 students visited China and Taiwan for school immersion, cultural exchanges, and CCA competitions. Most of them are from our primary and secondary schools. We will continue to support schools in making such opportunities available to our students. The Speak Mandarin campaign, now in its 33rd year, also launched a new theme song which caters to a younger audience. The lyrics are pretty much um, the campaign message which encourages you to uh, just speak more, and uh, you shouldn't find any excuses to uh, not want to speak just because you're afraid you would make mistakes. What inspired you to compose the song? Well, uh, when I was first approached by the council to come up with a song for the so-called MTV generation, so uh, I thought, yes, why don't I try to, to capture the, the mood or, or especially a dance, dance beat, you see? So that's what I, I went through the whole range of this K-pop, the J-pop, and you name it, you see? So that's how I came up with the lively beat first. And then I added in the melody. But obviously, I'm not a, a Mandarin songwriter. I got Nicole, Nicole Chen to write out the lyrics, plus added in this rap element. Next up, check out what people think of the new iHuayu application.